Everybody's talking about making a murderer, Stephen Avery. Have you heard the news? What? Ladies, he is off the market, okay? Hearts are breaking wide open. Wasn't he off the market? <laughs> well, he's currently serving a life sentence without parole. Side note. Hot, uh, by the way. Very hot. Yeah. Okay, you've seen the picture. There he is. That's his mugshot. Okay, he found love. Look at this woman. 53-year-old Lynn oh, Hartman. Right? Oh, she's beautiful. Yeah. She looks so cute. Okay, and I guess how it went down was eight months ago. She started writing him notes. Then they talked on the phone. Then they met for the first time last week, and wham, they're engaged. We don't know if there was a ring or a bottle cap, but they, there was a proposal. Wow. Okay? And here's what he said. People, this is love. This is going to go the distance. Oh. I feel good about this one. Uh, he told the Daily Mail, quote, she's going to be my future wife. We'll be laughing You're forever. Sharon looks I'm so happy. Like she treats me decent. She loves me. She's kind of spoiling me right now. How's that going down? I just want to be happy and enjoy my life. I think I did. Enough time. Ladies, take it away. Oh. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to jump in here right now and say for the record that I think that this guy's innocent. So that's Duh. my opinion based on but my... Would you marry would him? You, well, no. <laughs> I don't want to marry dudes that are out of jail. But my point is, it seems crazy, but we've seen this story a million times with pen pals, with women that yeah. kind of get obsessed with these guys. She watched this TV show. She probably felt like she knew him. That's not the same as marrying someone. <laughs> I will say, they did, they did talk on the phone every day for eight months. So they may have a real friendship. Who knows? I... My first thought was like, oh, no luck on Match.com. Like, you know, <laughs> like, uh, yeah, yeah. I wasn't sure, like, what draws you to the prison system they in the first place. Like, but I agree. You groupies. There that's are, that's like, what they are. I agree with Aisha that a lot of people think this guy is innocent. So I find this one a little less weird than the other ones. I, I, I believe that he's innocent. I, I innocent, he's innocent, innocent, guilty, whatever. He still looks like a no. <laughs> Oh, and Ozzy's just so attractive, yeah. Sharon. Well, here's my... Oh, he's like Lisa from Lord of the Rings. What's your, what's your right, Mrs. Oh, we call them either a uh, jailhouse group, groupies or courtroom, courtroom cuties, and they seem to like the person no matter what they are, but where's he going to go? It's you can't danger. take them anywhere. You can't go anywhere. Right. You can't do anything with... And if, first of all, you got to be a big criminal for me to want to marry you while you still incarcerate. But ladies, here's what I thought. So I've been with my husband for 22 years. Is it kind of perfect? You can visit when you want. You know, if you're having an off week, you're like, see you next week. You're in total control. I mean, is there something to this? You can dress up when you want to go. You get in a fight. Yeah, I'll see if I see you next week. Right? You can. I don't know. Hit me out. Is there something to that? Uh, but but I am what you going to do when he break out of jail and find you at the house? Uh, what is the safety? Nobody's perfect, all right? right. Kid Hoover, thank you thank so you. much.